Welcome back. Well, it's Friday, and you know what that means. The Humane Society of Wichita County is here with a furry friend that's looking forever for home. Today we have Mr. Doyle. Doyle. Yeah. There we mm -hmm. go. Tell me all Doyle's about Doyle's about three years old. He came from Oklahoma, so he said he got to Texas as fast as he could. <laughs> so now he's looking for a forever home. He's a great dog. He'd be a good size with kids. Uh, you know, he just seems very laid back and calm. He was here doing sledding on the carpet. Yep. <laughs> he quite enjoyed doing that. So, And it kind of looks like he's smiling if you yes. look real quickly. I so think he's a terrier, maybe beagle mix. I don't know. There's a lot of terrier there. Yes, but. absolutely. So kind of walk me through the adoption process. Okay. How does that work? Okay, just come on out there and find one that you like. And if you have another dog, you can always bring it out for a meet and greet. The adoption fee is 110 I think it is. And, uh, He'd be a perfect little guy for someone, for a family mm -hmm. with kids. I think he'd be perfectly fine with children. He's a big enough size where they're not going to be able to pick him up. Uh, we do require that you have a fenced yard if you have a house. And of course, if you rent, you must have your landlord's permission to have a pet and probably have to pay a pet deposit. So, but he's really sweet. You can always do an overnight visit with him for $40. And if that works out, that money would be applied to your adoption. So. But he's a sweet boy. He really is a very nice dog. He rode over well. He walks on the leash real good. I mean, he's just a perfect, just looking for a forever home. There you go. The perfect lap dog right there. If you're interested, the phone number is on your screen. And they're always in need of donations. Just, so just head on down to the Humane Society of Wichita County. Thank you so much for Thank coming on the show. Thank you for having us. Yeah. Well, still to come on KFDX 3 News at noon, we'll tell you about a local church that is hosting a food distribution drive tomorrow. Stay with us. Oops.